Some viewers may find the following video disturbing. Viewer discretion is advised. Well, hello and welcome back to the channel, everybody. In today's video, we find ourselves in New York City, where, uh, well, good guy audits or uh, good guy activism or whatever the hell he's calling himself these days attempts to, uh, well, film inside of a child support office and winds up getting booted right out the freaking door. So let's go ahead and sit back, relax, and enjoy the show. The film. Private property? How is it private property? How can a government agency be private property? Well, gee, I don't know. Maybe the government agency is renting a piece of private property because it's cheaper to do so? I mean, that could be it. I mean, it's been known to happen. How the hell is this private property? If this is HRA. Wonder who owns this property. Cause we got some private entities here. But as you know, once you open your private property up to public entities, it now becomes public publicly accessible. But still not free from being booted out or trespassed, as you are about to find out, dude. I mean, how many times have you been trespassed out of government buildings and you still haven't freaking figured it out yet? I mean, come on now, dude. Your brain can't be that defective that you can't learn that simple fact. No, wait a minute. Yeah, it can be. I mean, you dropped out of the, what, the fourth grade and you tend to suffer from the Dunning-Kruger effect where you think you're the smartest man alive, but you turn out to be a complete moron or something like that but don't worry you could share the uh kitty table with the the likes of chile de castro and uh a long island audit on all the others i mean you're welcome at that table a little longer than a few minutes later it's all penal code Oh, yeah. Uh, everybody knows that if there's no penal code on a sign, then that makes the sign automatically unlawful. I mean, uh, what about this sign right here or the other signs that you see on a, a daily basis throughout the city? I mean, are those unlawful, too? Because I'm sure the majority of them don't have penal codes on them either. Hey. Hey, David. Lisa? Hey, David. Hi, how are you? Mr. Minola, how are you doing? Ah. Why are we here today? He docks me? I'm a public figure, so it's okay. okay. Of course, I'm a public figure. How can you not? Oh, yeah, uh, you're a public figure, all right. I mean, you are so well known for being the guy that gets arrested at least once a week in the city of New York. Public figure, maybe, but definitely a public nuisance most of the time. You know you need is it against the law? No. This is a public lobby. You Policy know I'm here. If you know me, then you know I'm here peacefully. Policy don't supersede law. Right, so your we policy doesn't supersede my constitutional rights as long as I'm peaceful. Absolutely. Right. But there's still no video. You just said 
Your policy doesn't supersede mine. There's no law. Can I get arrested for it? No, it's a policy. You just said policy doesn't supersede David, the law. Yeah, but you still got to follow the policy of the building. And if they uh, say no eating, drinking, or anything else like that, do you think they'll make an exception for, uh, well, filming in a building that has clients in it, that has personal information floating around? Uh, no, I don't think so, Tim. Don't change your subject. You literally just said that. Policy doesn't supersede law. Don't so change it. I'm not going to get arrested for it. Well, if I ask you to leave, if you're recording, yeah. Why would you ask me to leave? Come on, I'll give you the opportunity to leave. Why would you ask me to leave if I have a right to be here? No recording. What are you here for? Public information. See? On what? Just whatever services are provided. That's that's all public this information. Is child okay. Can you, you get case? the Can you get the phone number for me? Do you have the case? No, I'm not on we, child. We I'm not on child support. We've been through this before. Yeah, I tried to do a public records request. Remember? Two months ago, we gave you information. Two months ago. That was last year. Yeah, somewhere around with about what? No, that was last year. So you remember me? Of course, and I remember you. Yeah, I remember certain things are and you memorable. Props, I respect that. Yeah, I'm respectful, bro. I'm polite. I'm I'm polite. I'm peaceful. David, I know you. I see your videos. How do you, you do? You yes, support my channel? Yeah. Oh, I support your channel by watching it all the damn time. I mean, where else can I go to find somebody so stupid as you are? I mean. Well, there's not that many choices other than uh, Chili de Castro, and you kind of get tired of his condescending attitude all the time. I mean, there's only so much of him I can stand. But you, you've you got this kind of stupid that really doesn't get annoying. It just kind of showcases your lack of education. It's, it's kind of what, like watching a train wreck. You want to look away, but you can't. You know the name of my channel? Good guy activist. I appreciate you. Shout out to you. From good guy audits. Yes, you the man. I appreciate you. And you also with my man, um, uh, Elijah. <laughs> you love people's first names. Eli. What's your first name? My first name is Thomas. Thomas. That's a nice, that's a noble name. That's nice. Yeah. Okay, someone can you give me the can you give me the phone number, please? Sure. If you got the video. You, you want to go worldwide? Come on, man. You know you're gonna go I'm worldwide. I'm already worldwide. All right. So. But you can't record. Why? David, don't give me a hard time. You know I could record. David, you know I could record. David, I'm not giving you a hard time. David. Can you give me the information and then I'll leave? I'll do you the favor. As soon as you start recording. David. Give me the information, on, Thomas. Please. Come on, Thomas. Please. I'm not gonna let you I'm not gonna let you violate my rights. I'm sorry. I'm not violating your rights. I gotta say so I gotta say inferno on what I believe in. So, if you give me the information, I'll leave. Cool feature. Yeah, I'm gonna get your information right now. Thank you. Where's the law? Policy. We've right. been through this. Policy doesn't supersede the law. This. You said it yourself. David. Policy doesn't. You can't put policy over the law. Yeah, but policy is enforced. How? Not criminally. Well, when you give your kids rules, is it law? Come on now. You Come compare, on, David. Answer you comparing that. apples and oranges. I'm not. Please. You, what's that say? Please, please respect. That means, please respect. That means it's a don't request. Stop recording. Once again, you uh, put on full display your lack of education by quote mining that uh, particular sign right there. I mean, that is one sentence right there. The first sentence is a request. Yes, that is a request to respect the other clients. But the following sentence gets you into the... Uh, prohibition of electronic devices within that building which is strictly observed so dude uh stop cherry picking because you're not that great at it oh you want to open you yourself stay. up to a lawsuit if you stop recording you can stay can i pray in here this is not the mrbd can, hmm? can i pray in here can i pray in here you can pray all you want right there right stop that means recording. i can record no recording <sighs> mm -mm -mm. If you don't stop recording, you will be placed under arrest for trespass. You gotta ask me to leave first. I'm gonna give you the opportunity to leave. You have to. So can you please leave? Under threat of arrest? If I don't leave, you gonna arrest me? For trespass. If I don't leave, you gonna arrest me? I'm giving you the opportunity to leave. You're not answering my question. If I don't leave, will you arrest me? We just said that. I didn't hear you. Yes or no? We just said that. If you don't leave, I'm gonna place you under arrest for trespass. Okay. And right. I've already asked you to leave. When are you asking me and to I'm leave? I'm giving now? you the opportunity twice. You asking me to leave now? Yes, sir. Oh, okay. All right. Appreciate I need your, I need your you card. Outside, you My boy watches us, right? You probably hate on us on the low. 
he says on the first he says, yo, you are so contradictory. Did you know that? Well, you know, you can change it to whatever you want. All right. We got to get language. Yeah, Davey, we all know how contradictory you are as well. And we all know the fact that you like to cherry pick your arguments. Uh, and uh, it didn't exactly work out for you this time, did it? Now, did it, dude? Even though apparently this officer is a fan of yours, you still got kicked out of the freaking building, dude. I mean, come on now, dude. When your own fans are not exactly on your side in this scenario, I mean, what can you do? Well, nothing exactly except for take a walk of shame from this point on. So, yeah, that's all you can do. So, at any rate, guys, I hope you enjoyed the video. Thanks for watching, and I will see you on the next one. Dude, so there's no way I can get in, bro? Come on, I'll put you on my YouTube. But shut up, Wesley. You gotta put signs up, ma'am, if it's- Are you Glenn Serio? Who's that?